Welcome back everybody into a new series. Now this is the first video of a very long series. I think, I hope not, but I would assume it will be long. Is a series from uh, 1K to 10K. So it's a sort of challenge. We're going to do a um, back testing, more long-term back testing on gold. We're going to try to achieve um, from starting from 1000 to achieve 10k uh, account. So I'm going to choose one date between 2016 and now, of course. And uh, actually, yeah, can't really be 2021 because uh, I need, I think I will need more than, <laughs> I don't know how much time. Let's see. Uh, this one, 14 of March. Two thousand nineteen. There you go. We start with one K. There you go. GMT. This one is always two pips spread for the commissions. And we are good to go. Of course, we're going to use the one minute. The one hour. And we should be good to go. We're going to risk 2%. 15 pips stop loss. Uh, no, I, yeah, this is not right. This is not right. Let me try again. Just give me one second. There you go. We're going to try again. What is this? Okay. 2019, May 14th, 1K. Okay, 1K, 500, even if we don't need it, fixed, 200, 4, 200, that should be good to go. The one minute chart. And the one hour chart. Okay, so we should be good to go. Let's see. Very good. Very good. This is the one minute. Yeah, I don't need the, the spread. As you can see, 2% risk. 150. 600, uh, of course, blah, blah, blah. start 1k as you can see here. Sessions, news, okay. So, mm -mm -mm, let's go to free London. Oh, okay. Very nice, nice fun. Uh, we don't have any level that the first one is at 14 and then okay we're going to use five sensitivity areas um, etc let's go on the USD for the main news today is the 14th what we have tomorrow Nothing. This week we don't have anything. Anything really impacting. Natural gas. Okay, so let's see. This is the session time. And this is the 
controller. So let's see on the one hour. Uh, doo -doo -doo, okay. So we are on the one hour time frame, as you can see. We're going to identify some areas. So of course we have these previous laws here. We have these previous laws, one, two, three, four times. This PSA. This one, okay. and more recently, this one here. Okay, so what is Pyth doing? We can see that we are in a clear bullish trend so far. We can even put it like this. I don't really like this color. Orange. Okay. We are in a clear bullish trend. We corrected most of this move, but we mm, don't know exactly if we are like 50%. I use it only for the percentage. Where are we? We are almost 50%, a little bit less. Very good. So we are in a bullish trend after this rejection. So this will be the price sensitivity area, the level make or break area for price to continue down and then resume this bearish trend. Or if we bounce again from here, then we can make we can be making a new lower higher low to then continue up um, up trend in a bullish trend. Okay. Let's see. So this hourly candle close above this PSA. So the next hourly candle. Uh, we are two hours before New York, uh, London open, can make a lower week and then start con uh, staying above. This is very important if we stay above uh, prior to London session. On the one minute chart, I need to... Um, okay. Very good. So these are the PSAs. Uh, we can also give you some uh, credibility. And we have these eyes. These eyes as well. Do, 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 bounce from here. Uh, bearish trend, and now we are the hourly candle, uh, the new hourly candle, because, of, okay, yeah, the, this is the, the close of the previous hourly candle, was really, really uh, interesting, so, mm. because it started down here and it closed right above. Very good, okay. We also have this PSA, very recent PSA, the chart up. Okay, 
let's just see um, how it goes. So this might be the hourly lower week, as you can see, lower week, and then let's see if it keeps bullish. Okay, okay, so it is um, bearish. Okay, this is a very small range. I am very zoomed in. But anyway. Mm -hmm. So we are below, we are, we created a flat candle body support here. Was this, um, let's see. Was this a candle setup? Can we justify the entry here at this bounce with multiple candles closing above? The range is very, very small. Yeah, to get the full take profit, we should really retrace all the way up. So for me, I think it's better to just wait. Um, for London, pre London and London session. We are getting some nicer candles. Still no enter for me. This is a nice setup. Looking below. So the point is, is the same. To get the 30 pips, we need to get there. Sixteen pips. Yeah, I think now this um this point the fifteen pips stop loss is kinda overkill, yeah. I think I will lower it to 10 pips and the 31 is uh, 30 pips. Okay, yeah, I'm kind of confused of the the, the candles here. This candle was a ni really nice setup. Yeah, 10 pips is well above this previous price activity area. Nice rejection of these previous lows. Here, 10 pips. We have enough range, we have 20 pips to the next key level. But we are at this very recent PSA. But we already broke it. No, here we bounced from it, so better not to enter now, entering only below. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't like it, selling at the PSA. This might be a nice candle, but it's a counter trend. First stop, not really good. Okay, so now this is London Open, and you can see very nice more volume in the candles. Um, we have the lower week being created here, and it's very important to see if we are going to bounce from here, 
and continuation up. Wow, to be next level, 20 pips. It's crazy, it's crazy. I'm kind of shocked right now. Um, yeah, 20 pips just to get there. Let's see if we break above this previous PSA. Okay, this, uh, this is actually a nice candle. We grab some liquidity, we give 10 pips, we are still above below here. So I think it's fine to take our first buy. These are two pips, damn it. Wow. And of course we have our first partial that we're going to take at 20 pips, which is over here. Yeah, not the nicest by section. We are very strongly reacting here, so we might decide to take a minor loss at four or five pips. Yeah, all we can do like this. We close the sixty percent now, and we leave. We uh, have minor losses in case we go to the stop loss. Okay. Okay, are we closing below strongly below? We get a retest, but of where? Where did, what did we retest? No candle setup. How do we have so small ranges? It's crazy. Yeah, this was a nice candle. Six pips. I'm testing this area here yeah. and continuation down. But we are against this key level, so we might you know, consider taking something one to one. So we are now seven pips, but we went to 10 pips. Yeah, we went to 10 pips. Yeah, we go to break even and we close partials. I think I have to adapt to the smaller ranges that are here. Okay, we get to 20 pips. And I think also we got to 30 pips.
we broke below these lows. Now we might have this PSA to be apt. We have a huge PSA over here. Let's see how we react to this PSA. Yeah, nice. I was saying that it's very good that we create a flat candle body support here, but too fast to enter. So this is 45 pips. If we get the take profit, it's good. Very good. So we get the take profit. here uh, so where are we now so yeah from here we drop 50 pips weird that's so weird now 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 what do we look for So on correction, we might even expect a deeper correction. From here, we have like 20 pips. 10 pips is not above here, but is well above these previous highs. Mm -mm -mm. No. Nope. Mm, mm, mm. I like how it got rejected, but we don't have much of a range. I mean, we have 20 pips to go to retest these previous lows. Hmm. Nice, and below. And then was kept bullish. Let's just I don't like this rejection at all. Close partials. Okay, now yeah, we are seeing some rejection reaction here. Do we break above? I like that bulls are in, are in control, are uh, present, but I really don't like how it is going. So I will close this one. And uh, if we see a clean, much cleaner break and retest. Why is not computer last man? Yeah, then I will take some further buys. Very good. Possible some liquidity grab here. Still one hour before New York open. Are we continuing the bearish? How was this candle? Up, down. Not a lot of signal, not a lot of milliseconds here. Ten pips will be around here. Fifteen pips will be there, but yeah, it's too much.
I don't like this engulfing bear, bullish candle, but I see that bears are very present in the market. Now coming towards New York Open, we are reacting at this PSA, we are up 10 pips after all this, 12 pips, yeah. Uh, since we are getting closer to Jesus, we're getting closer to uh, New York. I don't want to get topped out unnecessarily. So we took 50%. Yeah, so this is New York Open. That was down here. This is New York Open now. Lower week. Yeah, possible continuation up. Yeah. Looks like we got a double bottom here, and we're now creating a, um, a bullish trend. If we see some further bearish action, I will re-enter. For now, I close it. Yeah, good choice. Nice bearish candle after this huge rejection. And up, and then close bearish. Where are we on the hourly time frame? Yeah, we are reacting here. We are the first half an hour. We don't have any news. <sighs> to, to, to. The point is, do we have, what is the range we are talking about? We have 30 pips to tap this level. Not that no. Let's see how it goes. Maybe 10 pips. Yeah, I'm not liking the bullish pressure. Closing 50%. Yeah, very strong bullish action. Not really liking it. Closed the position. This is a much nicer candle. Yeah, three, four candles, bearish candle, but we are still, we are still making lower highs, so I'm not going to enter there. This is a much nicer. Okay, 10 pips will be here, but this is still very low. The point is, we don't have enough range. We have 30 pips to get below here. We still have these previous lows to be broken. Jesus, this one was a nice entry. This one was a nice entry. Damn it. And this one as well. 10 pips. No, 10 pips would have been stopped out. Yeah. So this choice was right, but I should have entered here. Why didn't I enter? New hourly made that here oh, as well. Here, look, why did I go that fast? We have the new hourly candle, no, not even top week. 
Yeah, this kind of close is the entry. This is kind of setup entry, 20 pips here. This is the setup. 20 pips, break even, 80%. And we let the rest run risk free. Retest, oh, nice retest. Small week, very high risk, a reward. As a, as a reversal, but yeah, better not to play with fire. I think I will close it. Yeah, 10 pips. Yeah, this would have been a nice 3 to 1. Da, da, da. This one is a nice one. Down and breaks below with very nice candle. We have 10 pips. The point is, I can't use 15 pips if the range is so small. I mean, honestly, 30 pips is 2 to 1, it's actually getting nice. Yeah, I had to use 15 pips. I can't, I can't do anything about it. Yeah, we have 30 pips as a first take profit. Ah, I don't like this rejection, I don't like it at all. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see at the level. Yeah, don't like it. 50%, get out of the way. Nice, give me a nice retest. Uh, below, below. Yeah, it's nice. It's fine. It's fine. We are reacting. Oh, nice. This is a nice candle. We are reacting again here, but it's a very high risk reward because we just bounce. We don't have enough range. In this case, I can use 10 pips. Yeah, but it's showing some a lot of bullish. Jesus Christ. Just wait a second, guys. I have to close something. Yeah, close it. So on the one hour, we bounce nicely from here. So I'm not going to sell, absolutely. Thank you, Stefano, for your always great ideas. This is a much nicer, give me a top week. No, no top week. Yeah, top week and flips, nope, doesn't flip. Bullish entry, this is very possible, very likely. Nope, sorry, in this case, 10 is more than enough.
There you go. Yes. Okay, I want to see bullish action like it is. My song rejection, but it's bouncing, still bouncing from this level. Yeah, not anymore the one I love. Reducing the risk. 50%. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm out from here. There you go, I'm out. There's not, this is not the transaction that I want. I can get my 10, 12 pips. It's not the, the bullish price action I want. If I want to re-enter with a much cleaner price action. Okay, very good. Look at how small the candle became. We're coming towards the last hour of London session. Yeah. Yeah. We also get below the new hourly after London close. Uh -oh -oh. Poof, poof, poof. Do we trust the volume? Do we trust the volume? Not really. Oh, nice, nice, nice retest. This is a much nicer retest of the level. But still the candles are very, very small. This jump. Do I want to enter here? Do I? Yes. Fifty percent. Yep, stopped out. We manage some risk. And this is it for the first day of trading. First day we are up two percent which is very nice, we're going to save it. And this is it for the first part, guys.